Hey, welcome to Dude with a Microscope. As you might guess in this episode, we are going to take a close look at the wing of a monarch butterfly. A friend of mine found this poor guy deceased in a park somewhere and brought it home and thought that I might enjoy taking a close look at it with one of my microscopes. So I'm gonna put it under the dissecting scope here. Butterflies and moths belong to a great big group of insects called Lepidopterans. That means scaled wings. When you hear Optera, which you will hear a lot when you're studying insects, that means wings. So there are helicopters which have wings that spin around. That might help you remember that Optera means wing. They have these little scales, as you can see on their wings. They're really quite beautiful and it's almost like little pixels on a screen. They uh, come in different colors, very small little tiny pieces that work together to make sort of a mosaic and patterns on their wings. Why do they have those? As far as I know, it's mostly just to give them color. Those colors can help butterflies in a lot of ways and moths. There are moths that have patterns on their wings that look like great big owl eyes to scare off a bird. Uh, the monarch, of course, has these orange and black colors to warn birds that they are poisonous to eat. They're not deadly, but they can make them sick. So those bright colors are something that birds can easily uh, recognize and remember. And butterflies are beautiful. They are beautiful to us and they are also beautiful to each other. So it's a way of saying, hello, here I am. Aren't I handsome or aren't I beautiful? So I hope you enjoyed seeing the scales on that butterfly's wing. It's pretty cool to see, isn't it? If there are more things that you want to see through a microscope, Give me a shout in the comments below and I will see what I can do. I'll try to keep these videos coming at you if you're digging them. All right, thanks so much for watching. Bye.